The Russia leaps, that is Burevesnik, that is known as a 9M730 storm petrel missile system. This is the system in which it is also known as SSC X9 Skyfall, reported name by NATO, is a ground launch low flying cruise missile. Its key characteristic is that it is both nuclear capable and nuclear powered, which Russia claims gives an effective unlimited range and ability to evade modern missile defense system. The futuristic design says that these are key claimed capabilities, effectively unlimited range, can fly low and take unpredictable paths to bypass the missile defense systems right now which is all over the world is actually been deployed. Recent test shows that Russia claims a successful launch of 14,000 kilometers for 15 hours of missile flew and it's an unlimited range. The status was under development but right now Russia is, has said that it is being actually deployed and very soon it will be used to protect Russia against Western powers. The context is the technical challenges. Now there is a technical challenge for the safety as nuclear threat initiatives and the Bureau of SNIC has been uh, actually with a poor test record in the 13 known tests. But right now it's been a marvelous test which is highlighting the potential of Russia regarding what kind of capabilities it is having more than the Western propaganda. Strategic value, some Western analysis Analysts actually questions this strategic necessities. They argue that it is a subsonic night speed and can be detectable despite of the unpredictable path and it may not be adding any kind of capabilities to Russia. This is the old phenomena of Western people or Western media that they always actually demoralize the Russian technology. The same Russian technology is used by India also, which is known as Brahmos, which we developed on our own way. So the geopolitical messaging is very simple. The announcements at the test are seen as a part of the Russia strategic messaging and to the West by showcasing an invincible weapon, Russia signals its military technological powers and proves the defiance and against the Western pressure, particularly regarding the war in Ukraine. So this is a grave concern right now for Westerners or Western people or Western media or Western countries that they believe that they were technologically ahead. Right now, I don't think so. They are ahead. There is a game changer known as Bureau with Snick. So please keep on staying with us. We'll update you with more with this thought. If you like this, please subscribe, share, and please be with us forever. Thank you very much. Keep studying. Bye bye.